Okay, so that's enough collecting crystal lizards. We gotta get out of here now. I gotta head back to Firelink Shrine and some stuff will be different and it'll be exciting. Uh, I'm looking forward to it, sort of, I guess. And it's very exciting. And I know there are still. Oh, I hate Blight Town. There are still crystal lizards there. I know that they are still there. I hear them twinkling, but I realized that I was starting to turn into the crazy guy from the Telltale Heart, so I had to stop. I had to just put it down, take my Titanite, cut my losses. Either the guy from the Telltale Heart or um, a Compulsive Gambler. Same, same difference. There will be blood. Drink, drink it up. Okay. I'm getting it. Shut up, Rob. I like my frame rate just fine. Can't even hear you because you're dumb. Okay, so I'm in the depths. Hey, check out this uh, phantoms. Uh, so I'm in the depths. Finally made it. Some funny guy put a message under one of those slimes that drops on your head, and it said up. And that was funny because I was like up, and then it dropped on my head. And that guy's a jerk. So I'm gonna reinforce that bandage knife with some of my large titanite shards that I spent all that time looking for lizards for. And hopefully I can find some more, because I'd really like to finish upgrading that thing. Alright, so we're back. See, this guy's here. Myself? I, I don't care. Have you heard of Big Hat Logan? Master Logan is a great sorcerer and my teacher. Both of us came to this land as undead. But one day, he departed, leaving only a note. I suppose he wished to keep me out of harm's way. But where does that leave me? I have dedicated myself to sorcery. But Master Logan could find no use for me. Sounds like he's got some self-esteem problems over here. Alright, I'm not into sorcery, so I'm going to ignore you. Goodbye then. Do stay safe. Oh, right. I'm definitely gonna kindle up this bonfire because I really need to not be in Blight Town ever again. What's this message say? Imminent despair. Did you ring the second bell? That is incredible, I must say. But now we have a new problem. It's noisy. It snores. And its breath is lethal. This is no laughing matter, I tell you. That's it. Damn. That stench. And I was really beginning to like it here. Oh. <sighs> Maybe it's time I do something about it. Okay, whatever. I really hate that guy. Um, let's see. Is there a firekeeper lady here? You're damn right she is. 
and she still can't talk. But that's okay. You know why? Because she's not dead. And I know I could have resurrected her or whatever, but I also could just have avoided her dying at all. So that's what I prefer. Oh, hello there. You've been a why? Tell me about it. Why, yes, of course. Thank you for sharing. I'm still an able pyromancer. I shall locate him myself. I'm in your debt once again. I don't know what just happened. What what did we just talk about? What did I say yes to? Pyromancy is the art of casting fire. Produce flame, then channel it. Just as our ancestors did. they? Did. A pyromancer must be in tune with nature herself. My home, the Great Swamp, is an abundant store of nature. You will understand one day. It only takes time. Pyromancy has a, well, rather primitive aspect to it. It messes poorly with advanced culture. And pyromancers are considered rather unsavory. Which is fine, as I never got along with anybody anyway. So, for me, turning undead didn't change a thing. <laughs> a pyromancer's flame is, is a part of his own body. The flame develops right along with his skill. When I gave you that flame, I gave you a part of myself. Please take good care of it. Please take. Cool. It's kind of a cool little conversation. So I can modify this. It just costs money. That's pretty great. Let's pyromancy it up. Oh, I can get more souls. I'll get you your three thousand souls. Uh, I don't need this. Hey, didn't I get this and didn't it suck? Goodbye, Goodbye indeed. Okay, what else can we do over here? Wait, what? Oh, these are the tooltips. Oh, I'm sorry. Sometimes. join this covenant for now at least so what covenant does that put me in that's the way of white is that the one where people help each other or is that praise the sun I don't know oh I'm so okay so I can't talk to him anymore he's, he's over it he's done with talking what's force Okay, so we're going to head back to Undead Asylum again. Because I went back there, I got the items, but I got to kill that boss. I'm not, I'm not letting him get away, the stupid Asylum demon. Let's talk to this creeper. Ah, hello. Was it you who rang the Bell of Awakening? I am the Primordial Serpent, King Seeker Frank. Close friend of the great Lord Gwyn, chosen undead, who has rung the bell of awakening. I wish to elucidate your fate. Do you seek such enlightenment? Yes, I do. Very well. Then I am pleased to share. Chosen undead, your fate is to succeed the great Lord Gwyn. So that you may link the fire, cast away the dark, and undo the curse of the undead. To this end, you must visit Anorlondo and acquire the Lord Vessel. You know, I, I complain a lot about this game, but it's kind of cool that you don't know what the story is or what's going on until the middle of the game. 
which I'm guessing I'm sort of in the middle of the game. 